okay, so this is the real reason why Destiny is upset with Sonny and Moses. She wants to have all this smoke for them because she wants to keep us out of her real storyline, which is her divorce from LeBerry. Please feel that tea, sis. Well, actually, now I understand why she couldn't because it's in her divorce decree. But nevertheless, she got a whole lot of other stuff going on with this man. And I feel like that can somehow be woven into a storyline instead of this Moses Sonny type of situation. That was not your husband or your baby dad. So why don't you just let us know what's going on with LeBerry? Because this stuff is kind of interesting. So as you can see, this article starts out by saying Destiny Payton held in contempt in divorce case and received suspicion suspended jail sentence girl uh-uh see if i had all this going on i would not be worried about sunny and most i'd be like oh good luck to them i couldn't even be mad like destiny you was a whole wife you was whole married to another man and you have a whole kid i don't really get it but whatever so it says an update occurred in Alabama court involving Love and Marriage Huntsville star Destiny Payton's divorce and legal issues versus her ex-husband LeBaric Williams last week. A judge ruled against Destiny in her ongoing divorce dispute against LeBaric. As reportedly, uh, as previously reported, LeBaric reopened the divorce late, late last year and accused Destiny of not following their divorce decree. Now listen to this, y'all. In various court documents, he claimed that Destiny made it very difficult to sell their marital home after the divorce. It also went on and said that Destiny be like late to the pickup and drop offs of their son. And what's another thing? See, see, missing or being late to multiple pickups. Mm hmm. Um, it says she failed to help pay the mortgage on property and certain medical bills for their son. So I'm like, sis, you have a whole like divorce you need to go here i know it was finalized but you need to be adhering to what's going on with your divorce because i would not be on national tv worried about sunny and moses if i had all this going on in my life so it says destiny must adhere to all aspects of the latest divorce decree to stay out of jail including not speaking despairingly about labaric and following their co-parenting schedule she must also pay labaric $12,000 for attorney fees. This includes a fee she was supposed to give LeBaire per their decree modification in 2023. And you know what? I kind of like that part about their divorce. Like, okay, you cannot speak about me or whatever. In this article, it mentioned how Destiny was sent up there talking about this man in interviews despairingly. And they're not supposed to do that. And one thing I guess I like about LeBaric is like, I haven't seen him. I mean, he's adhering to the divorce decree because honestly... When it comes to a marriage, we don't need to be a part of it. We don't need to know about it. And we don't need to know about the fallout effects either, unless that's what both parties choose to do. So I appreciate LeBaric not, because he could do the same thing that Destiny's doing, but he's not, you know, and we could keep it that way. Some things we don't have to know about, but I would like if Destiny took us on her journey of being a new divorcee with a new baby. You know, I find that interesting. You know, maybe showing how she's getting back out there dating after Moses. You know what I mean? Stop trying to act like this man is the only man in the whole entire world because he's not. Like, yes, what Sonny did may have hurt you, may have been shy so you confided and opened up to her. But at the end of the day, he is not the only man and you'll have some other friends. So just come on in, Destiny. Be that girl. Stop all the hate. Stop trying to be all sad and disgruntled. Like Melody said, this was not somebody you was engaged to. Y'all were not married. Y'all didn't have any kids together. So you really don't have any ties. Yes, the situation is messed up. I'm not going to say that it's not. But at the end of the day, you are a free agent, sis. So you need to get, get it together and go back out in the dating market, okay? And show that you can do better than Moses. Show that you can do better than LeBaric. Since he's trying to sit up here and play in your face and be, you know, dragging you to court in a way, it's almost sounding like the reverse of Martell. Like, usually the men be acting up when it comes down to, like, the divorce or whatever. So it's interesting seeing, like, the woman being in contempt or, you know, all this other stuff and being late to drop offs and pick up. Now, I know that could happen because life was still, you know, I just, I find this very interesting. And this is what Destiny needs to make her storyline within staying with the divorce decree agreement you know what i mean i'm not trying to get her to get sent to jail but i'm pretty sure the way producers are the way we could come up with it they can showcase her life revolving this without you know violating anything 
So it says, according to the order, all money must be paid to LeBaric within 30 days to avoid serving her sentence. And this is her sentence up here, guys. So it said, they issued a 45 day suspended jail sentence for two years. The judge also issued nine five day sentences for each charge to be served consecutively. Girl, let's get it together. You know. Get it together for baby law. You know, he's probably not a, a baby no more. You know what I mean? But let's come on in, Destiny. Uh, come on. Now that I know, like I said, she had all this stuff going on in her ex-relationship. Uh-uh. Mo Moses, no, 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 no. She, mm-mm, mm-mm. Girl, you should just kept that to yourself or maybe told us about it, but I wouldn't be staying on that too long. You got bigger fish to fry, sis. So, phew, let that go. But other than that, let me know what y'all think about this article from UrbanBailMag.com. Destiny Payton Hell and Contempt in Divorce Case and receives it receives suspended jail sentence. See? Mm -mm, she should have been worried about her own self and what was going on in her, you know, post-divorce stuff. Because this is, no, 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 Destiny. This is not a good look for you, sis. Other than that, let me know what y'all think. And I will talk to you guys again soon. Bye. Matt St. Quedic, man, a girl was having sex. Matt St. Quedic, man, a girl was having sex.